guys, it's Melissa and it's happy, what day? Thursday, I have my little helper Blake here who is trying to stay out of the picture, but he is here because he is actually going to run the show my during this Facebook show. Live. You this. You just said that was your helper. You are my helper. All right, what are we doing? Tell, tell the people what we're doing. What are we doing? We're doing a heat transfer vinyl and we are throwing it way back to basics. So that all the new people who got it's 2014, them, yeah, 2014, just like I was when I first got my machine. And we don't so, have to wear a mask. Right. And we don't have to wear a mask. Okay. Yeah. So we are going to, um, do a, basically an intro to HTV mm -hmm. and Blake's going to help me because Blake is a pro is at HTV. He likes, maybe. yes, yeah, so you like to make stickers. shirts and stickers. He likes print and cut the best, but okay, you're going to help me with this. Now, what we have, um, I have a very basic design. Don't this even design, have a dog. I know, but we're, maybe we're, we'll just do this, um, and give it to somebody as a gift. Okay. So this design I selected because it was already created. It's part of the so fancy dog bundle, which I threw the link up. Um, but it's an ideal design because it's got thick lettering. It's got a big, bold design. It's going to be difficult to mess up. Now I'm going to say that and what's going to happen? We're going to mess, mess it up. What's the last time? Okay. All right. So one thing that you need to keep in mind with HTV is what do you have to do to your design in the software before you cut it? Just press send. You do have to press send. But even before that... Get a computer. You have to flip it, okay? You have to flip it backwards. Oh, yeah. And so, because why? It cuts um, from the reverse side. So you just need to right-click your design and click flip horizontally. And mm -hmm. all that's going to do is to change it so that it flips backwards, okay? Now you can't read it. It's right. Just... Yes. But after we cut it, we will be able to read it. Okay, so what color? Your job is to help me purple. decide. Purple. So we have two purples. Whoops. This one's fine. Okay. So oops. we will use this purple. And when you are cutting HTV, you can use a mat or you can skip the mat. We are going to skip the mat and you are going to cut from the back side. So the clear shiny side is going to be down while you're cutting, which is why you need to flip your design in Silhouette Studio so that when it's done, this is going to flip onto the shirt the correct way. Yeah. Now, this is where we are going to load this into our machine. And um, I am not cutting with a mat. As I said, we're just going to skip that. it backwards, Mom? What? No, no, we're going to do it this way. Mm -hmm. If we click our load button, just load it right in there. Okay. Whoops, I loaded it sideways. So we want to make sure it goes in evenly. Okay. And now we are ready to press that send button that you are so excited. So we're going to go to the send button and from the material list, you are just going to select in this case, heat transfer vinyl smooth. Um, my suggestion is to increase the force from the default to a force of 14. That usually helps to cut um, HTV a little bit better uh -huh. than the defaults. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. And I am going to no. increase the speed just because... Um, we don't want to keep people waiting. Now, yeah. we're going to send this, and it is going to cut our design. Now, what do we need to do after it cuts? The picket. The what? <laughs> what is this? The picker. You called it the picker. <laughs> I did that on my, our game of, like, family feud that we yes. played. Yes, this is a weeding tool or a hook, some people call it. Blake calls it a picker. He's a very good picker. Um, and what this, you do with this is what? Weed can you stand stuff. up? So we can, weed stuff. Weed stuff. What does weed mean? They don't, because if they're brand new, they don't know. Well, it's like uh, picking stuff off of the vinyl. I guess. The, the excess, you're removing the excess HTV so that just your design is remaining on the carrier sheet. And then that way, you can put your design onto the surface. In this case, we are going to just put this onto a cotton bag, okay? Oh no, look what's happening. We messed up, we, like we said. Yeah, of course we did. Oh goodness. All right, so. Maybe we should make it say Happy New Year. Our design went crooked. We need to pick a different color. Crooked. Oh, no. no. Come on. 
This is not right. I gotta go to skate. Why, why did you? You're fine. This forever. We're gonna, gonna try this one more by the time we're over. We're gonna try this one more time. Why did that happen? Because you jinxed it. Yeah, you're right. That is why it happened. Okay, so we're gonna try it one more time. You need to um, make sure that your design is um, flat. flat, and you need to make sure that both sides go in evenly. If they don't go in evenly, they will the um, vinyl will begin to shift. And what you're going to do that on purpose. What happened like, here? So we could show them. Our design purpose. shifted. Our vinyl shifted, and then it cut over itself. So now we have wasted that piece. Well, no, we did that on purpose. Uh, yeah. Oh, for the teaching moment. Uh, totally. Right, okay. So, what we're going to do now, and we have a heat yeah. press. How many heat presses do we have? Like five. Yeah, but today, because beginners, most beginners don't have a heat press, we are going to use an iron. Why don't we just give some away? Well, I actually have we get stuff. one like every month. I know, I have a lot of stuff. Um, so, what we're going to do today is use an iron for this bag, okay? because a lot of people that are just starting out don't have heat presses, so we are going to show them how to use an iron. I'm gonna just leave this for right now. Now, why don't you demonstrate what weaving is on this piece so that they can see um, what you mean. Like, try to take some of the letters out here. You're tired. How can you be told them three hours ago, okay? No, you didn't, because it's only nine. So this is going much, I'm not even gonna say it. Um, now, if you've been around a lot, you know that the reason that I do Facebook Lives is so that you know that I struggle sometimes with the same things that you do. We okay. all know. Yeah, we all do know that. Definitely. Okay, so now, this is all done cutting. We've done a lot of Facebook Lives. We have done a lot of Facebook Lives, and our Facebook Lives always stay on Facebook and over on the video yeah, section, not on Instagram. and they also go onto YouTube. So before I remove this from the machine, I'm going to do what I like to call a little test weed to make sure that it has completely cut through. And by doing that, if it hasn't cut through completely or well, I can resend it. So I just, this has a bunch of letters, so I just um, weed one of those out and it's like a test cut. Okay, so this works. So Blake, we're all done um, with that Why? now. Okay. So now, this is where everyone yells at us and tells us that we are wasting vinyl. Where's my scissors? Can they like whisper at us? Blake, why are you doing this? I don't know. I don't know where my scissors are. So oh, I, I think I do. Did you take them? No. Where are they? I don't know. Okay, help me find them. I didn't them. take them. Okay, so we're going to weed this. Uh, do we use this thing? No, no, no. That's for uh, rhinestones. Uh, Look. What's a rhinestone? We need to weed oh, yeah, this. this and you're going to help me. Uh -huh. Okay. So weeding, we need little scissors because it'll help us to cut some of this excess. Oh! Oh my gosh, I was blaming you and they were right here this whole time. No, no, no. Okay, so look, once this starts to... Okay, Whoa. now, when you're weeding a large piece of HTV, what? keep some scissors nearby and kind of clip it. Here, you move this chair to the side so you can stand yeah. to the side so that they can see. No. Now, I'm going to do it this way. Stand over here so they can Just see. Said to come over I know, but you need to stand so they can still see. But I'm always standing. Okay. Not now, face now we're going to start pulling this off. Can you help? You pull. Uh -huh. Remember, pull, no, no, no. Oh. You're pulling this piece. Mm -hmm. And you have to use the scissors as you need it to help you so that the piece doesn't get too difficult. It's like a water balloon. Okay. Now, again, we picked this design because it's good for beginners. It's um, a dog design, which, what happened to our dog? We had a dog. We ha Yes, and then what happened? Mm -hmm. We had you, and I was like, I can't. I can't, I can't do two. I could have. No. You, I know. I love I know. dogs. I know, I'm sorry. Amy was awesome. She, we, had, five seconds her. we adopted her out a long time ago. Okay, so let's see what's going on. This looks like a giant mess here. Move to the side a little bit so they can see. Okay, so look, we're pulling this off. Now, 
typically what I would do is add what's called weeding lines. I did Hi, not do it. that today because I'm literally mm -hmm. trying to do this as a beginner. If you are a beginner, this is how you would be doing a first project. Mm -hmm. And I actually suggest... What time is it? I, I'm not sure what time it is right now, okay. but it's not time for you to leave. Yeah, I know. So just keep helping me, please. We need to get a lot. Please keep helping me. I am. Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh. you got to go slow so you don't... What do we use the scissors for? We haven't used them. Yeah, so that we can trim. There Ow. you go. Sorry. Ooh. Sorry. Gotcha. Okay, I know. that's waste. This I is what they that. always yell at me yep. for. It, it happens, guys. Mm -hmm. It happens. Okay, so now you take your picker <laughs> and you know what to do. And no, no, no. There's nothing in here. In the letters, you have to remove that inner part. Okay, we'll pull them up here so they can see exactly what you're doing. Okay, so all of the letters, like A, O, R, P, D, have that little inner piece called a counter. And we need to get those out because we don't want to press them. Okay, did you get them? It looks like we got everything. Okay, so now what do we do? We put it in the heat press. Now, well, typically we do put it in the heat press, but today, remember, we're not doing the heat press. Oh, no. We are doing, whoops, we are not doing the heat press because if they're a beginner, they might not have a heat press. So we're going to show them how to do it with an iron. That's All right, so old it's old fashioned, I know. But when you're a beginner, you typically, you know, don't have a whole lot of supplies. So we want to use what we have. Okay. So I have folded my, um, we have folded the bag in oh, half. Wait, do you know why we did oh. that? What? Do you know why we folded the bag oh, in half? Yeah. Oh. Why? Okay, I don't know why. Okay, we did it so that we can do a crease line down the middle so we know where the middle is. Okay. And then we are going to also fold this transfer that we just made in half so that we have a middle line on that too. And then, what do you think we can do, Blake? We're going to put the crease into the crease. Yes, I mean, we've got something on our... Yes, no, so we... What'd off. you do? Up. You got it? The no. one that we messed up? Yeah. Up. Oh, thank you. Okay, really? now it's time to press this with our iron. Okay, so... I have this. I'm just going to put this pad down. You don't have to do this, but normally you'd be on an ironing board. Now, we need, where's that stool? It's right here. Okay, so you need a lot of pressure and downward pressure for an iron. This is where a heat press comes in handy. When you are using an iron, you are not going to iron like you would traditionally iron. Blake, tell them how many times you've seen me iron in your life. Zero. Zero. You are not going to do that. You are just going to stand and press in iron size sections, which is why you will very soon see We're not that a heat press is well worth the time, money, and effort, okay? So you're not going to iron like this. You are just going to press in iron size sections, right, Blake? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. And you have to get the whole thing, and usually... I would be doing this on the floor, but because I have all of you with me, we're just doing this up on the table, which is why I was asking where our stool is. I don't know where we need to I stand. That was for Dad. No, no, that's a new stool, but I have that other little stool. Isn't it? Isn't it? Yeah. Oh, it's right there. Oh, that's not new. That's from our kitchen counter. Yeah, our old stools. Okay, so let's see how this is doing. You despise this. So that side's not ready because we didn't press it yet, but this uh, side you can see is starting to stay down. Don't burn yourself. I'm not gonna burn myself, but I am gonna I kind do of it like this. Facebook live. Yeah, so that's why I need you to help me because when this, oh, that's hot. You just said don't burn yourself. I know. Okay. Several of you were asking about, they were asking about dad, how dad's feeling. Oh, he's good. Yeah, he's getting much better. Thank you for your concern. Me and Blake and Olivia did not catch COVID. Yeah, that's why I'm going to the skate camp today. Whoop, whoop. We get to make a new skateboard. Okay. All right. So let's see if this is ready now, Blake. I think it is. Okay. Don't um, fall off the cliff. You're going to jinx. Okay, so now what you do is you peel off this clear transfer. Okay. And if it has ironed on well. And that, wait, is it? Look. Okay, it's sticking on. It's coming off. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
Now, again, if we used our... Let's give, let's give this to someone that has a dog. Okay, that's Not fun. a cat. If you gave it to someone that has a cat, they would really hate us. Just be careful. And if you need to go back and press little areas, make sure that you don't press directly onto the HGV. You need to press through the transfer tape. Why? Wait, why is that? No, because if you touch the iron directly onto the HGV, it will melt it. Uh, and it will be like not good. Spray paint. Yeah, I got a little bit of areas right here I need to fix. All right. This is why I'm not doing the iron. This, iron. well, yeah. Oh, the irony. The irony. That yeah. was the lamest joke I've You're ever very made. funny, Blake. Okay. So but lame. also, this is why we like to use our heat press because it makes it fast and easy. But look. And we don't so burn there we go. Uh huh. Where did we? Hello. We yeah. put this back in the store. Super cute, right? All of it's the same thing. And the design, as I said, super easy for mm -hmm. newbies, newbies or people who've had their machine for seven newbies. years. You saw how mine went a little cockeyed there. But um, anyway, this I I would highly suggest if you are brand new to start with heat transfer vinyl because it is one of the most forgiving um, projects, one of the most forgiving designs, easy to cut, easy to weed. Um, if you were using um, H, or excuse me, vinyl, adhesive vinyl, what ends up happening when you are cutting, when you are weeding is the vinyl can sometimes stick to itself. So you need to use a couple of tricks, which... We didn't you get need, into today. You need weeder thingy. Yes. Someone's asking, have I ever done a live on multiple colors? What HG? is that? Like if this design had multiple colors, have we ever done a Facebook live where it had multiple colors? No. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. We've done hundreds of we Facebook have? lives. Well, maybe you haven't because you're usually at school. Uh -huh. But I have. Come over here so they can see you because they don't know who I'm talking to. So um, uh -huh. anyway, thank you very much for joining us. Happy New Year. Bye bye to 2020. We can't wait to get out of this year, right? Yeah, but the beginning maybe of 2021 in, is going to be like. Uh, maybe 2021 it will be a better year. I'm not sure it could get in <clears throat> much worse. Okay? All right, you guys. I hope you have a fabulous day. Yes, stay fabulous. safe, stay healthy, and happy new year. Mm hmm. Yeah.